Hey, I'm Kathy Harding. We're in the Seville Newsroom. Uh, we're at 308 East Main Street, which is across from Rapture on the downtown mall, and you should come and see us sometime. We are talking to Jason Whitehead, and Jason has our cover story, another excellent piece in our continuing coverage on area homelessness. Two months ago, the Hope Shelter closed down, and from what I can tell, we have a great deal more homeless people out on the street sleeping outside. So the question is, what is the the plan to help these folks in their immediate state of need? There doesn't seem to be one. What is the plan to help them long term? A long term plan is uh, enunciated by city councilors uh, that deals with uh, providing more affordable housing, which of course could be a, a really long term plan, and then uh, something called SROs, which are uh, permanent housing for the worst of the homeless, but it would only provide space potentially for 60 homeless, and we supposedly have 300 or so, so that would leave the rest of them without uh, any assistance right now or for the foreseeable future. This is a really complex issue, as you well know, and Jason's story this week really goes through the whole kind of list of elements that contribute to our area homeless problem. So read it here on the website or uh, pick up a copy anywhere around town. We'll see you next week. I'm Kathy Harding. This is Jason Whitehead, and we are in the Seville Newsroom.